hi guys welcome back to besame and i know you're all gonna rejoice with me today because we are at 500 subscribers i could not have done this without you thank you so much for your support i remember when we were at 100 and uh, we went out on that beach trip i've put that video right here in case you missed it then we were at 150 then double that 400 now 500 subscribers and i'm just so grateful to all of you and then there are some special people that i really cannot leave out like doreen humby i'll put a link to her channel below she's a little fashionista she's here in halifax nova scotia as well but she's more into the fashion and stuff like that you can check out her channel and there's mikey laughs believe me for those of you who know me you know i love to laugh right well mikey beat me so please check out her channel i'm gonna put all the links below and there's rich davis the man that had promoted me on his channel with his uke and uh, oh my gosh all these people were so instrumental in getting me to 500 because they actually sent people over and they were like rich davis sent me or doreen sent me or mikey sent me and it was just amazing i really appreciate all of you so much thank you for all of your support and now we are here at 500 i really would like to take you out somewhere but of course we are under a lockdown so I'll read you a short story I can't read a long story today because I'm studying I've got an exam on Sunday that's really really important I'll tell you more about it after but I can't get into the details right now because I just wanted to tell you we are at 500 and let us rejoice together and just thank God you know it's been great <laughs> Anyway, the story I want to read to you today is The Greedy Dog. The Greedy Dog It was a warm day in summer. A kind butcher gave a bone to a hungry dog. The animal was happy and wagged his tail. The dog ran quickly down the street. He carried the bone in his mouth. On the way home, he had to cross a stream. The dog looked over the side of the bridge. In the water, he saw another dog. The other dog also had a bone in his mouth. He jumped into the water to fight the other dog. The dog wanted to steal the other bone. He thought that it was bigger than his own. The silly creature was nearly drowned. He opened his mouth and lost his own bone. It sank to the bottom of the stream. The greedy dog went home very sad and wet. Now he had no bone at all. The end. Well, that is a great story and it teaches a lesson. In Jamaica, we would say, want all, lose all, right? Yeah, if you have something, it belongs to you. It's no use looking at somebody else's thing and thinking, wow, that thing is better than mine. I want that thing. No, just be satisfied with whatever you have because that is your portion. That is what God wants you to have, right? So anyway, thank you so much again for helping me to get to 500. I hope you liked the story. If you did, please remember to give a thumbs up for it share it with your friends and if you have not yet subscribed to this channel please consider doing so help me to get to a thousand now thank you so much for watching bye bye